How's everybody doing today? I'm doing well. Thanks for asking the body beat down here. Michael, hump day. Let's do chest and legs. All right, guys, you heard the opening. We're going to get to work. All right, we're going to be doing chest and legs. And uh, we're going to keep it kind of on the down low today. Doing something a little different. We're basically going to be doing a bunch of sets of five reps. And we're going to be doing slow controlled movements. And we are starting out here warming up with 135. And uh, yeah, so we're going to have a pretty good workout today. I know that because I've already done it. Uh, you don't know that yet. Well, well, yeah, maybe you do, because I just told you. So, ah, uh, there's that. So, uh, yeah. Anyway, we're going on to another warm-up set, 135. And uh, so today, we got a little news uh, concerning our uh, the selling of our house and the new house we're looking at. So, our banker and our realtor and everybody's pretty much got the paperwork and everything, uh, everything done where we can close and everything on the day we're supposed to be out of our house so we can move out of our house and into our new house which is a good thing and that takes a lot of stress off of us so that's one thing we were stressing uh, we're not used to you know not having a place to live you know you always try to have a place to move into uh, whenever you're ready to move so uh, that was kind of stressful but anyway, you're noticing we're up at 225, and we're going to do these nice, slow, beautifully controlled. Going down, we're going to do some nice pause reps, and uh, just sets of five, and uh, really good workout. Felt really good, actually. And uh, it's not that 225 isn't heavy. It's not like I took a super light day. 225 is still a good amount of weight. But it's at that point where, you know, I can pretty much handle 225, um, I guess with ease, you could say. Um, but it gives me a good workout. Uh, 225 is just a good solid uh, weight to get to whenever you're doing everything from bench pressing to squats, shoulder presses, bent rows, deadlifts, everything. It's just good for everything. It's at that point where it's enough weight that it can make you big and strong. And uh, I really like 225. It's kind of like, it's kind of like a little baby, you know? It's kind of like that little baby I never had. I don't get to claim taxes on it though. That kind of sucks. So here we are, doing another set, 225. Nice, beautifully controlled, feeling good. Uh, had a pretty good hump day so far, I guess. Um, as of making this video, we, uh, I haven't ate yet supper, so I still got to get supper going. Sometimes whenever I do videos, I run behind on supper, and sometimes I don't. It just depends on how I, how I go about. A lot of times I'm preparing my supper as I'm working out. So I put everything on low and just let it cook, and within an hour or hour and a half or so, and it's done and ready to go. So, another beautiful set here at 225. Good, good weight, good form, good day, good bench. And a uh, yeah, nice pause there for sure. And uh, I think we're gonna be moving to legs, maybe? Yeah, we're moving to legs now. So we're doing some free weight squats. We are starting at 135. Those are 45s on the end. And the bar is roughly 45. So you got roughly 135 pounds there, guys. Gym weight is tricky uh, if you don't know what you're doing, if you don't know what you're adding up. Most people forget to add the bar in there whenever they make comments. Uh, it looks like 90 pounds, or it looks like 50 pounds, or it looks like that. Well, you didn't add the bar. So uh, if you're gonna if you're gonna make a statement like that, it, it's best if you just say, uh, "Do you mind explaining the weights to me? Because I can't make it add up to what you're saying it is." And uh, you know, and then we can explain things a little bit. So uh, as a good set of 135, and uh, 
I'm going to go ahead and show both warm-up sets here since we're keeping the reps nice and low. Um, trying to keep it nice and controlled. Of course, squats have always been my worst movement, but over the past, you know, several months, uh, I have really come a long way with them, and I'm feeling good uh, whenever I do them. And uh, my max is that I can get a good rep, like you're seeing, like with this. My max is uh, 365 for one good solid rep. I can probably do a couple, but we'll leave it at one rep. Um, once I get up above that, it just starts really compromising my form and my back and, and everything, and it just don't work out so well. So I've kind of topped out at 365 with my squats. That's an extremely amount of uh, extreme amount of weight, though, if you do it at least to this depth. And uh, I try to get parallel, and I try to go below parallel free weight squatting, but it don't work real well. On my Smith machine, I can go below because there's not a whole lot of balance involved. It's just following the bar down and letting it take you down as far as you can go there and, and going back up. And it's a lot easier. Uh, I say that with a grain of salt. It's not easy, but it's easier. You don't have to, to worry about that tipping uh, backwards or forwards because you're locked in there on the Smith machine. Uh, the weight itself is still pure heck. So, and uh, plus going uh, even, plus going past parallel uh, makes it even more difficult. So, yeah. So we're doing 225 again. As I said, we're going to keep it uh, 225 today, and we're keeping the reps at five. And uh, really enjoyed this training today. I uh, had a good day of training. Got my walk in this morning. I did a video this morning, but the subject I was talking about, I, I decided I didn't want to share and upload. And it was just kind of a, it was a downer video. And I didn't want to be a downer. Uh, I don't mind being real on my channel and, uh, and discussing even personal life and personal things and stuff like that. But I just felt like maybe I should not upload that and so I got rid of that video and well we'll keep it positive so my walk done today of course my spinning on the bike is done I do those things first thing when I get home from my morning bus route I step off the bus and I put my stuff on the table and then I instantly go back out and start so all right, doing pretty good here at 225. Some of the reps look a little better than others. That's normal. It's normal to have that happen. Uh, and if you hear the, that in the background, it's my wife's yapping dog uh, yapping away because that's what he does. So, uh, yeah, this is our last set of 225 squat. And I didn't point out that I have two plates there. I hope people understand there's two plates there. You're going to have people say, I only see one plate. I think the other one's fake. They're different sizes. Good Lord, man. You're trying to fool us. There's some tomfoolery going on. Name no tomfoolery. Don't be stupid. Anyway, guys, if I inspire you a little bit along the day, along your way to do something healthy inside and out, uh, then I've done my job. And I don't care what it is. You can work out or... Do whatever it is you want to do. Housework, garden, I don't care what it is, as long as it's good and positive and decent for you. Alright? Like, share, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff to the body beat down, if and you would. And, uh, you know, while you're at it, why not, um, I don't know. Uh, come on now, come on. Get up, get out, get rad, and do it to it. We'll see you next time on the body beat down. Peace. Get up, get out, get ran, and do it, do it!